eyes could not deny. We're headed back into the heart of Arkans Empire and you're singing. What better time? Anyway, where we're going, no one will be looking for criminals. Most of the people there are criminals, which of course presents its own dangers. I do enjoy visiting the old world. It's a piece of Zakul history. Valkorian's first attempt at creating a grand society. A failed attempt. Only in scale. To him, it wasn't nearly grand enough. I want to know more about your relationship with Valkorian. The story really isn't as outlandish as whatever you're imagining. We met after I earned a place in his elite guard. I never hesitated to speak my mind, which caught his attention, I suppose. He was fascinating, bold, always completely certain of his next step. If I were describing you, I'd say the same things. You're flattering me, but yes, somehow we had a fair bit in common. What we had wasn't a child's notion romance. But we were happy. Then Arkin and his brother Saxon were born. I loved them so much. But no matter what I did, they wanted nothing to do with me. And Valkorian wanted nothing to do with them. His mind was somewhere else. He barely spoke. Barely acknowledged any of us for weeks at a time. And then Valen. Valen was troubled from the start. Was she really dangerous, even as a child? She made furniture move while she was still in the womb. Tore droids apart as a toddler. Once a guard dropped a ball she tossed, Valen crippled him. I confronted Valkorian. His daughter needed help. His sons needed him. His solution was to cage Valen's mind. Most of her power was locked away, along with most of who she was. He ignored the rest of us outright. I couldn't stand by and watch. I gathered the children. I tried to tell them we needed to go. They laughed and called me weak. Even as children, even with Valen's power restraint, the three of them together were still far more powerful than me. I couldn't force them to go. So... I left. I can't imagine how hard that must have been for you. Better than being trapped there. Helpless, I transferred to the Knights Enforcement Division and took assignments at the outer fringes of our empire. Valkoria never spoke another word to me. Since then, I've only seen my children in broadcasts of public events, like Thexen's funeral, killed in the Core Worlds. I doubt they even remember me. Hello, little one. T7, what do you have for us? The Lady of Sorrows is wanted for murder and theft of state secrets, among other charges. The Knights have hunted her for years. No one's come close. I'm sure the three of us will manage if we work together. You may not believe this, but it's rare for someone to escape a Knight's justice. And when that someone is the Knight's own child? We'll find out, won't we? Could I... Is it possible for me to talk to him? To Valkorian? I don't think it works that way, exactly. Lots of things live down here. Few of them friendly. We should be careful.
This is the old world as most of Kulans know it. A place to mingle with the rabble and then go home to brag about it. One big party. I have a contact nearby. Need to go alone. Don't keep me waiting. Won't be long. I had always intended to visit the old world. I thought I would have the time. Delightful. You couldn't have mentioned Senya was the mother of your children. I wanted to see what she would do. In the end, she chose to place her trust in you and your associates. She'll make a powerful ally. Intelligent, skilled, confident. And fearless. Oh, she does not give in. Priority call for High Justice Phelan. She'll want to know who I just spotted. Heralds of Zildrog. Cultists longing for the return of a mythical serpent god. Used to be they were just a nuisance. Now they're militant. Good show! Absolutely wonderful! Are these people for real? Their lives are uneventful. No hardship. They come here to feel... something. There you are. Sticking heralds on me, Reg? Not too bright. No, it wasn't me. The heralds run the old world now. They made a deal. With Arkin? What kind of deal? Heralds keep crying down, and the knights keep out. You stick around, they'll blame it on me. You gotta go. Tell me where to find the Lady of Sorrows first. Some kind of joke, right? I'll take my lumps from the heralds over the Lady any day. And where do I fit on that list? What? <laughs> you know what I can do, Reg. Need another reminder? Senya, stop. This isn't the way to get answers. It's the only way they understand. Back off and let me do my job. Wait a minute, wait. I was gonna say, you don't want to mess with the lady. Then I was gonna say, but hey, that's your prerogative. You've always been square with me, I'll be square with you. Don't gotta hit me. Where is she? I, I don't know. But, but I do know who to talk to. There's a data seller at Market Station, Mona Gale. She works with the lady all the time. Mona Gale, all right. <coughs> Sorry, let's go. Who I found. The Outlander? Right under our noses in the old world. Alone. Oh no. That's the best bit. Mother is here too. Shouldn't we go say hello? Why would they escape only to return? Let them do what they came here for. I'll see that they don't dawdle. <laughs> <laughs> 